So humans have a natural tendency to be curious and want to watch other people. Social media is a very good example of daily voyeurism. We enjoy looking into the lives of others. Voyeurism is gaining momentum because it's relatively harmless sexual fun if it's done with consent. Now, voyeurism is where couples gain pleasure from watching other people naked or engaging in sexual activity. Women love being watched and men love showing off their gorgeous, beautiful queens. Now, voyeurism is no doubt very exciting, but it's not without controversy though. So let's discuss. I'm Marissa Rudder, relationship coach and author of 12 books, soon to be 13. I'm an advocate for female empowerment and female-led relationships. Now, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe. So voyeurism is where people enjoy watching each other naked or engage in sexual activity. Usually the people doing the action are unaware, and this is where voyeurism can be an issue. Consent and knowledge that you're being watched is what distinguishes voyeurism from being a crime to being done responsibly. Now, voyeurism can take place with watching porn, couples engaging in hot wifing, cuckolding and swinging, where there's consensual viewing of the sex, as well as role-playing, or you and your queen watching each other masturbating. Once there is consent and everyone is an adult, voyeurism is perfectly acceptable. Now, where voyeurism becomes an issue is where people become peeping toms. You know, they go around watching each other in their homes or installing cameras in bathrooms. These are considered unhealthy and in some cases illegal. So always have consent. But where you and your queen can indulge in voyeurism fantasies is at fetish clubs or swingers lifestyle parties where just watching others having sex is encouraged. In fact, when you get into the world of cuckolding, hot wifing and swinging, watching is usually one of the first steps. In the swingers lifestyle, watching and engaging in voyeurism actually helps you to ease into exploring the lifestyle further so you can fully indulge an interest in voyeurism. Hot wifing is an excellent way to show off your queen and get excited watching. It's the ultimate thrill for men. You and your queen filming each other where you, privately where you can watch anytime is another way to engage in voyeurism as long as you're both in agreement. Now, many couples are very turned on by watching themselves in home videos, for example. There are so many ways to incorporate this fantasy into a healthy, consensual sex life. My books, Hot Wife, Cuckolding, and Swinging are all great guides, which will teach you about responsible voyeurism. And it can actually be very fun and exciting.